Hey guys, sorry about that. My last live stream had no volume. I, I forgot to do something. I'm still trying to learn how to do this stuff. Anyway, it's fun though to be able to do all this stuff and, and to do these updates live. I mean, it's it's more fun than having to record it and then go upload it. It's such a pain. Um, if I can ever figure out the technology, I'm just going to do quick live updates all the time. All right. Uh, so let's look here. Let's look at my screen. Let's do a, let's look at the spreadsheets first. And then we'll look at the charts. All right. So here's IWMY. These guys sold options at 2080 level. So 2080 is the max profit, right? So what's the market at right now? See that Russell 2388. Okay, so that's that's good. That means these are at a max profit right now. So 869,000. And now these guys are at a dollar five a share on earnings, which is which is incredible. Looking at a dollar twenty-two on the dividend estimate. Remember that could be off by a dime or a nickel, easily by a nickel or a dime, either way. So don't I, I hope anyone doesn't buy anything or sell anything because of that estimate. Do your own research. Um, you know, I think it's close, but I mean a dime can make a big difference. Last time I missed by I missed by a nickel on all three of them, but I mean, I could have just got lucky last time. So just be careful. All right, JEPY, these guys sold options for $15.55 at the 5245, right? Well, the market's at 5225, so our options are in the money. So we'd have to buy them back for about 20 bucks, right? Well, then we go over here, points in the money. Yeah, actually 1977. Okay, so instead of making four hundred thousand, we're losing a hundred thousand, which is not okay. I mean, uh, these guys were up to twenty-eight cents a few days ago earnings per share, which is decent considering how the month started. So hopefully we'll come back. Dividend estimate fifty-five cents. Triple QI, the, their strike was 18.410. So that's all we need to know. Oops, market's at 18.313. So that's what, 70 points in the money or 67 points? Something, I don't know. I know I have a, 96 points in the money. I, my um, math is not going well this morning, is it? Anyway, it's a, it's a big amount in the money. So these guys, instead of making a million four, are losing 100,000. And uh, their earnings per share have been going better, but they need to keep going that way. All right, so now, let's see, I'm gonna go show a different screen. There's probably a way to switch faster than I'm doing it to have them preloaded up in here. All right, here's a chart of Bitcoin. Man, Bitcoin's on fire today. That's a 30 minute chart. I'm going to turn off the Bollinger Bands. That is a 30-minute chart. I've been talking about this level being key, but right now it's been violated. Maybe they'll come back and backtest it. They've done that before. They passed it They passed it here and then backtested it and then here and tested it here. It's kind of a key level. We'll see. But anyway, uh, it's bullish for bullish for Bitcoin and bullish for these stocks. Um, look at this one today. This is uh, Mister, but this is what Misty trades calls in covered calls, and their covered calls already got blown out. That's good though. That's max profit. It's the same thing as the short put at the top line or above is max profit. Covered call, short put, same thing. So, oh, I'm sorry. I was going to look at some of these other ones real quick, and then we'll check out the indexes. We'll see if we can get these indexes to be positive on the defiance. But let's look at these single stocks. Now, this one uh, still has a ways to go on this profit box, NVIDIA. It looks like they sold the 995, and that's still out of the money. So that's good for those guys. We'll check out a little uh, Tesla. Okay, well, they're at max profit for the top box, which is really max profit for the trade. You want to be right at that top line of the of the top profit box you have. If you have multiples, if you have a ladder, that's 
that's a good spot to be. They'd probably rather be there at the end of the week. Um, we'll see, though. That This looks good, though. They're in good shape there. Let's check this out. All right, for triple QI, now look at this. The, the spreadsheet was showing a loss. The spreadsheet's 20 minutes behind. This, I'm trying to think. This may be too. Well, I don't know. Actually, no, this isn't. This is not 20 minutes behind. This is live. And so we're we're in the money. Look at that. We're in the money. We just need to keep going up. Hopefully, by the end of the day, we'll be closer to the top line. All right. So here's SPX. Let me make sure everything's going all right over here. Hope you guys can see everything all right. I don't have any comments, but that's fine. I'm not soliciting comments. All right. So here's JEPY. They have three profit boxes. I mean, not really. I just started, I added this profit box for IVVW, which is a new iShares cover call fund. It's a monthly fund. I'll probably take that. That box really doesn't show us much. But I don't know. Anyway, I just wanted to do it just for fun. Um, but then the main one we follow is this green and yellow one. And that's the profit box for QQQI. Top line of that profit box is max profit. Bottom line is break even. So on the S&P, we still need uh, need to be a little bit higher. The uh, the the uh, red box is a different kind of deal. It's a call spread that SPY T sells. And its actual max profit is at the bottom line or below. So for that trade, the SPY T trade is max profit right now. The SPY T option position is max profit. But on triple QI's option position, we need a higher price. Uh, so we don't have a loss all right and let's look over here at uh russell okay russell's max profit to say the top line or above is max profit nice job russell so so that looks good all right well hopefully this update worked better than the other one hopefully you guys had volume yeah i got a comment that it's been good all right well i think i got this thing figured out all right, guys, I'm going to end this stream, and I'll be on and do a stream at the end of the day. All right, see you guys.